What is going on my family? Your boy Demetrius is coming right back at you with another classic Tekken 8 slash Tekken related video. Here once again, as you can see, there was another poll put up by Harada involving Nina and Anna. Uh, as y'all know, a few months ago, Harada made a poll basically saying Nina or Anna and basically wanted people to choose. And the first time Anna won the poll convincingly, now Harada has come back and has done the poll again. I honestly don't know what Harada's got up his sleeve when he continues to do these polls. But the weird thing about this is it is the same poll that he did a few months ago. He wants Nina and Anna once again. And here are the results. The results are final. No more voting. This is it. 60,000 people have voted. And once again, Anna has come on top. Now, it wasn't by much this time. But still, a win is a win, and this is the second straight victory Anna has had over Nina when it comes to these polls that Harada has put up. Now, ultimately, we really don't know why Harada is doing this, but I will say a couple of things when it comes to this situation. Uh, I don't know if Anna mains are upset or shocked or surprised that this has happened again, that Harada has put this poll up again. But, you know, here's my thing. Words of encouragement when it comes to this situation. And this goes for every other Tekken character as well. Y'all remember the video that I did not too long ago when Eddie Gordo was revealed. I made a video on a big Easter egg when it came to Anna Williams. Now, a lot of people commented in that video saying that, nah, it's not an Easter egg. It could be an Easter egg. You know, it could be something. It could be nothing. But here's the thing. Now, if that wasn't an Easter egg in the video that I did, which I still believe it is an Easter egg, I still think those are Anna's lips that are on that screen. I want people to understand something. Anna is the only character, she is the only Tekken character that is not in the base roster that Harada is mentioning right now. Harada is not mentioning no other character in Tekken other than Anna right now. Now, forget what Michael Murray was saying. Forget what Michael Murray was talking about with that whole Fockham Rom shit, okay? Nobody wants Fockham Rom back and all that stupid crap, okay? But when it comes to characters being mentioned in anything, Anna is the only character that's being mentioned in anything when it comes to Tekken that's not on the base roster. Let's just keep it real. She's the only character that Harada is talking about right now. Now, that's not an Easter egg. I really don't know what is. Like, why would you talk so much about a character and decide not to put her in the game? So that's kind of like word of encouragement for Anna players. Like, look, she has to come back at this point because she is the only Tekken character that is not in the game right now, and she's constantly getting mentioned. So I just kind of feel like Anna is in the bag. I still feel like she is the next character to be revealed as far as DLC is concerned. And like I said, we ultimately don't know what the polls are all about. But maybe this second poll is a little build up. Maybe Harada did this. Maybe he's doing it on a gamble. You feel what I'm saying? Now, I will say this. Um, whenever something is done a second time, one thing that will come to your mind is like salty run back. Because at first when I saw this again, I figured like Harada may have been a little bit upset that Nina didn't win the first poll. Considering the fact that Nina was being pushed like crazy. Understandable, right? Even though, you know, a lot of us prefer Anna over Nina. I prefer Anna over Nina. You know, it is what it is. So I figure Harada was doing this kind of like a salty run back because he wasn't happy with Anna winning last time. That was the vibe I was getting in the last poll that he put up. He was really shocked that Anna won that poll. So for a second time, he put it up. And once again, he sees once again that Anna has won. So, you know, the people have spoken. The people have spoken once again. And shout out to the Anna mains, the Anna players, for coming out once again and handling business. You feel what I'm saying? I mean, this is really some exciting shit to see when it comes to the Anna players. And, and you know, somebody asked me, uh, isn't this the same as Christie stands? I'm like, hell no. This is nowhere near any Christie stand bullshit. You feel what I'm saying? Because Anna fans don't say anything. They don't say anything, nor do they make weird letters or nothing like that. Anna fans are just chill and, 
you know, they do what they do. They play the game or whatever. So what's going on here is nothing at all like Christie stands. Christie stands are serial. And to be quite honest with you, Christie stands need to learn a lot and take notes from Anna fans and what's going on. You feel what I'm saying? And I'll say it again. Shout out to the Anna mains for showing the community how you really do things, how you really support a character. And basically when things like this come up, you know, Anna mains and Anna fans, they be on it. They do shit the right way. And like I said, shout out to the Anna fans for showing that because the one thing about it is Christy stands can definitely take notes from what's going on with Anna fans, even though they won't, but they should. This is how you support a character. This is how you let your voice be heard right here. All you have to do is sit back and wait for the moment. And the thing about it is we know that Anna fans are doing something right because Harada did it a second time. This is how you do it. This is how you do things right. That bullshit that Christie stands are on, that's some fucked up cruelty shit. You feel what I'm saying? And it's sickening. You don't do shit like that. This is how you do it right here. And as a result, Anna wins another poll. And we can pretty much say that Anna is coming back in Tekken 8. Because I'm going to sit here and say that it would be really, I mean really, really totally stupid and messed up for Harada not to put Anna back in the game at this point. You made two polls, which Anna has won both of them. Anna is the only character that's coming out of Harada's mouth. I mean, come on. Anna is in the bag. So like I said, Anna fans, y'all got this. Y'all got this. She's coming back. I still say she's going to be the next character revealed because right now, Anna is like the talk of the town right now. And she's not even on the game yet. So like I said, she's coming back. There's no doubt about it. Like I said, I think it's going to be sooner than later. And once again, I'm going to give Anna players y'all props. Give y'all y'all shout out because y'all done things right. Y'all have been patient and y'all have really been showing the community how to really support a character. And I'm going to be all the way real. I thought Harada was going to continue the polls with other characters because I was waiting on that King versus Armor King poll. Even though Harada never said that he was going to do that. But I had a hunch that he was probably going to do that poll next. A lot of other people said that he might do that poll too. But now I don't think Harada is going to do a King versus Armor King to be quite honest with you. I don't think he wants to see those Armor King results because <laughs> he know Armor King going to blow King's ass right out of the water, man. It'll be a landslide victory for Armor King. So I don't think Harada going to touch that shit. <laughs> I don't think he going to do that, but uh, it would have been good to see if he would have did a King versus Armor King. But shit, who knows? He still might. He still might. But uh, but like I said, uh. You know, shout out to a couple of my followers that let me know about this. Like I said, Harada did this out of nowhere. I don't know what actual time that he did it, but he slipped it in and we caught it. And like I said, shout out to Anna fans for getting on this. And once again, Anna gets another victory over Nina. So uh, it's 2-0 so far. So if Harada decides to make a third, I think Anna would do the sweep for real. <laughs> You know, like I said, no disrespect to Nina players, you know, you know, play who you dedicated to. No disrespect. But, you know, Anna is on a roll right now. And you know what I'm saying? And she has the following to back it up. So let me know what y'all think in the comments section below about the second poll that Anna has won versus her sister, Nina. Let me know what y'all think about it. Leave y'all thoughts and y'all feelings in the comment section below. And we could definitely get a conversation started on this particular situation because everyone loves talking about the Williams sisters. So uh, let me know what y'all think. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe to your boy for the hottest Tekken 8 action on the internet, period. As I keep on saying, ain't nobody doing it like I'm doing it when it comes to this Tekken shit. And that is facts. My name is Demetrius. I will get back at y'all in the next video. God bless. Stay safe. Get ready for the next battle. I am out. Peace.